Hey guys, if you're shopping for knives and gear, make sure you check out the description of the video you're watching right now for links to some great online retailers. There's also individual links for knives that I personally recommend. Thanks. What's going on YouTube Middle Complex here and as I'm sure you guys can tell by the thumbnail we have a very exciting unboxing to do today. Um, thank you so much my buddy Ricky who has been uh, a part of the channel or at least he's been my friend for a long time but he was uh, around in the early days of the YouTube channel. Um, but uh, he uh, informed me that he actually picked up one of the new Tanto PM2s. I didn't and he was like, do you want me to send it? I was like, yes, please, please send it. So he sent it to me. That's what's in this box. I've not handled it or experienced it yet. I'm really excited to get into it. Uh, so thank you so much, Ricky, for doing that. And uh, please, guys, follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. Okay, let's not waste any time. Let's get into this box because I know you guys want to check this out. I'll be linking. I mean, like, you can't get this knife right now. I don't know what the future of this thing is. Um, you guys are actually seeing this on the day that I'm unboxing it, which is rare for this channel. I usually pre-record my content. I'll be linking Spyderco PM2s down in the uh, description as well as Spyderco knives in general. Sorry about the brightness. It's because I know that the knife is very dark and I, I know what the camera is going to do with it. Um, but yeah, you guys can check out Spyderco knives down in the description if you want to. All right. Here we go. Okay. Ready? <laughs> Okay, so listen, um, <laughs> I have grown away from the PM2 as of late, and uh, it's just, it's become kind of boring to me, and I don't normally like Tantos, but I gotta admit, that Tanto blade is pretty sweet. Um, the, you know, these were really pricey, and they went really fast, they were Blade HQ exclusive as far as I understand, I hope I'm right about that. Um, but, uh, and I'll link the original listings, depending on when you're watching this in the future, it might become available at some point, or I don't, I have no idea how they're going to do this. This was super expensive. It was definitely one of those knives. that was like, this is new. It's cool. Buy it now. All that aside, my own personal thoughts on that. We all have different thoughts on that. I got to admit that is a sweet blade. Um, this is the only PM2 that I might, I miss the drop on this, um, this is the only PM2 that I might consider actually buying for myself at some point just for that grind and just be for the uniqueness of seeing the PM2 in this blade shape. Boy, it does feel that's a much more robust blade than the standard PM. Let me get mine. Where's my PM2? So yeah, the PM2 design has remained the same forever and it's only ever had this blade shape. Now we've got this very aggressive Tanto. It's got a much thicker, thicker geometry this is hollow ground up front and then secondary grind is flat much thicker tip absolutely much more robust in general and just cool fact nice and smooth too nice and smooth this feels solid what is what is so different here i don't know maybe it's in my mind but this is god dang it just feels so it's got to be the geometry it's got to be more geometry geometry the tip up here, the end of the blade is just much more, it's much heavier. So the whole blade feels like additional mass. Let's weigh it. Let's find out the weight on this guy. Standard PM2 comes in something around three and three quarters to four ounces, 3.99. Okay, so this guy, it's a little bit heavier, 4.13. Okay, I'm not going to say that I'm so, you know, sensitive and knowledgeable about the weight of blades that I honestly picked that up, but it just felt, it just feels more blade heavy. Uh, I, I like the, I like the DLC on that. It's just, I mean, it's S30V, right? This is a DLC Tanto and S30V. It's made in the United States. It, it, it was very expensive and I don't know that I necessarily agree with that price. In fact, I definitely don't agree with that price, but it is cool, and I really wanted to show this on the channel. This is not a review. This is just an unboxing and first impressions. I will do a full review on this. I will try to get it out within uh, a week, so you guys can probably expect a video on this knife, a full 15 to 20-minute review, or at least discussion on the Tanto PM2. But I wanted to make sure you guys got to see this today. There are other people out there who have done videos on this, but I, I, wanted, I wanted this to be on my channel because I know how much attention is on this thing. Um, and it is interesting. It is, I mean, it, it's, it's, a, it's the same PM2 with a different blade shape, but because the PM2 has always been exactly the same thing for so long, 
and the, since well you know aside from the PM, the first uh, paramilitary um it's it, it was kind of a shocking thing to the knife community that we had this change in blade shape and such a dramatic one they did a good job with it everything's nice i really like the full blackout and the full you know all the black hardware and everything it's cool edge is perfect ooh very glassy smooth on that edge absolutely Okay, guys, I don't think this really needs to be anything else. Like I said, there'll be links down in the description for Spyderco knives you can actually buy, as well as all of the different PM2 variants that are available right now. Ricky, thanks again for... Without Ricky, I wouldn't have been able to do this. Um, thank you so much for sending this to me. It's really cool you got a hold of one. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, or at least mildly entertained by it. If you were, please leave a like if you'd like to check out my other content. I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do not like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on that metal complex logo right there and subscribe because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.